Easy Stash Units, an extremely convenient way to store all of your required emote clue items. And I'm going to show you an efficient route to take when building them all. Uh, this is Iron Man and walking friendly, although I will list proper teleports along with items to bring for that specific stash unit you are building, as well as the future too. On screen is a list of all items you will need as well as the amount of planks and nails. This should be noted, you need 10 nails per stash unit, however you do not need to bring more as the nails will not bend and you cannot fail at making them. First, you are going to want to start at just south of the Grand Exchange, and there is a stash unit here. It is a bush, and it's next to the hand. This requires a pink shirt, pink robe top, and a body tiara. Next, you will want to run east, just south of the rock, and you will need to bring a coif, a black axe, and a ruby ring. Next, run into the castle and up into the library. You will need to bring a green robe top, ham robes, and an iron war hammer. After this, make your way south to Aubrey's rune shop, you will need a water staff and an air talisman. Next, make your way all the way to the exam center. Bring green boots, a white apron, and leather gloves. Next, run north all the way to the lumber yard, and you will need a hard leather body, leather chaps, and bronze axe. Next, run directly east to the Rag and Bone Man quest start, and you will need a steel medium helmet, a steel pickaxe, and bronze legs. Next, the most efficient way is to find some sort of teleport that works best for you, but we need to make our way to the Sears Village. North of Sears Village and Camelot, you will need to bring a leather cowl, an iron scimitar, and a blue wizard robe top. Next, run south to the beehives, bring a desert shirt, green robe bottoms, and steel axe. Then run slightly south next to the giant bats, and you will need to bring a coif, an iron plate body, and leather gloves. Continue running south to get to the Legends Guild, and just outside of the Legends Guild, you will need to bring iron plate legs, emerald amulet, and an oak longbow. Now continue west, just north of Ardoin, and in the windmill, go to the very top level, and you will need to bring a blue robe top, ham robes, and a tiara. After that, make your way to the fishing guild, and just outside, you will need to bring an emerald ring, a sapphire amulet, and a bronze chain body. After this, make your way into Ardoin and to the zoo, you will need to bring studded leather body, bronze plate legs, and a staff. After this, make your way to Taverly. By the Druid's Circle, you will need to bring blue wizard hat, bronze two-handed sword, and ham boots. After this, go to Mudskipper Point. There is a convenient fairy ring, if you want to use that, and bring a black cape, leather chaps, and a steel mace. Then run north to Remington and bring a gold necklace, a gold ring, and a bronze spear. After this, make your way east to the Entrana monks and bring a coif, a steel plate skirt, and a sapphire necklace. After that, you will want to run north into Falador, and next to the gem shop, which is just south of the western bank, you will need to bring a mithril pickaxe, a black plate body, and an iron kite shield. Next, make your way all the way east to the party room, and you will need to bring a steel full helmet, a steel plate body, and an iron skirt. Next, either home teleport or make your way all the way over to the Alcarid Duel Arena. Just at the entrance, you will need to bring an iron chain, leather chaps, and a coif. Then make your way north. Continue north to the Scorpion Pit and bring a desert shirt, leather gloves, and leather boots. Make your way over to Lumbridge. Run south into the Lumbridge Swamp, and by the entrance into Xanaris, you will need to bring a bronze dagger, an iron full helmet, and a gold ring. Then run north, north of Lumbridge Castle, south of the windmill, and inside of the wheat field, bring a blue robe top, a turquoise robe bottom, and an oak short bow. After this, make your way west all the way to Draenor Village, and inside the market area, you will need to bring a studded leather chaps, iron kite shield, and a steel longsword. Run south to the wizard's tower, and on the bridge, before you get there, you need to bring an iron medium helmet, emerald ring, and white apron. Turn around and continue north to the crossroads at Draenor Village. Bring an iron chain, a sapphire ring, and a longbow. Then run north and inside Draenor Manor, and in the southwestern corner inside of the gate, by the fountain, you will need to bring an iron plate body, studded chaps, and a bronze full helmet. Next, run south back to the crossroads and make your way all the way west. Just west of the elemental wizards, you will find another stash unit. Finally, you will need to bring a green hat, a cream robe top, 
and leather chaps. I hope this was very helpful and convenient for you, and if you uh, enjoyed this and would like to see more of my videos, please like and subscribe. Have a nice day.